Dave here, how are you? Now this is a very basic video. There's one camera in it and that's all there is to it. It was when I was doing a recent project with the CNC and I realized I had the software settings incorrect. So I stopped the machine, opened up the G code in Aspire, changed the settings on the cutter, re-imported the G code back into Mac 3, used the touch plate to let the machine know where it was with its X, Y and Z axis, started it up and finished the job. It's a short video. You might be interested in watching it. Here we go. This is what I'm doing. I don't want it to take that long. So I'm going to increase the step over on the toolpath. The tool, we're going to edit step over. We're going to take that up to 80%. Close that, check the time on it, and that's brought it down to 15 minutes instead of two hours. Okay, now we're going to save that n mil inches, save toolpath to file, and we're going to do checkout there, replace it. Yes. Done. I think that is going to be a whole lot better. Close. Yes. Now we're going to go to Mac 3 again. And we're going to load the code. And it's going to be the same one, but it's going to be a whole lot quicker. Done. Going to re redo it. Turn the variable frequency drive off.
Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.